In this tutorial video for On Deck Baseball, we are going to go over stolen bases. Now, stolen bases is obviously something you want to do in a given situation where you want to get somebody into scoring position. You're going to try and do it with your faster runners. You're not going to do it with the, uh, well, let's just pull them out here, the John Garlands of the world. You're going to do it more with the Billy Rollins of the world. So two things come into effect in stolen bases. Uh, now, this is going to be in the pro version of the game, not the basic version. Uh, in the pro version, you have to see if your runner on first base gets a good jump to attempt the steal. <clears throat> and then once he does get the jump, then you can try and attempt the stolen base. So what we're going to do is here we have our pitcher and catcher tandem for the Knights. We have Rudy Yates pitching. You'll notice that he's a minus two on the hold. And we have Valenzuela catching. He has a two arm. So not the greatest tandem to hold back base runners from stealing, but let's see what we can get done here. So first attempt is to try and steal the base is Rollins. We're going to take his jump, which is a five, against the hold runners for Yates, which is a minus two. So that's going to be a plus three on a confrontation roll to see if Billy Rollins gets the jump. Just like the confrontation roll with the uh, hitter against the batter, or sorry, the hitter against the pitcher, we have to see if it's a six or above to see if Rollins gets a jump. If it's a five or below, Rollins does not get the jump and he cannot steal. If he doesn't get the jump, he can't steal the rest of this at bat. You would have to wait for another batter to be at bat before you can attempt another steal. So we're going to go ahead and roll. It is a plus three on that confrontation roll. That is a seven. So we do get the jump. We can now attempt the steal. We're going to flip the card over and see that stolen steal in second base against a two arm that Valenzuela has, and Rollins has an 80% chance of making it to second base. So we'll go ahead and roll. We get a six, and Rollins steals the base successfully. So that's a stolen base for Rollins. We're gonna go down the lineup a little bit and do a little bit of variety in the speed and the jump ratings so you can see a difference. So now we have Walker attempting to steal the base. His jump is a four against a minus two hold runner. So it's a plus two on a confrontation roll. Again, six or above, he can steal the base. Five or below, he has to hold the base. So we do get an attempt on a steal. Walker has a 70% chance of making it against a two arm. We'll go ahead and roll. He gets a two and he sneaks in a stolen base there. So he is safe. At second as well. Going down the lineup, we have McClure, who doesn't have a high jump or high speed. So against a two hold runners, he has a two jump, so it's equal confrontation roll. Six or above, he goes. Five or below, he stays. And he stays. He doesn't get the jump, so he stays at first base. Neil Millar, he is similar to McClure. A two jump against a minus two hold. And he gets the jump, so he can try to attempt to steal the base. He has a three speed, so an average base runner against a two arm. And he has a 60% chance of getting to base safely. A four, and he is thrown out. So out of three steal attempts, two were made. One was thrown out by Valenzuela. So you could tell that it does pay to have a better catcher with an arm behind the plate, especially if you have a fast team like the Phantoms. Um, but sometimes there's a trade-off. Valenzuela does have a little bit of power, so you're getting a little bit better stick in the lineup uh, against an average defender with a little bit of a weaker arm. So that is stolen bases for on-deck baseball. Uh, went over the jump to attempt the steal and then the stolen base itself. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, leave them below for me. If you have any suggestions for additional tutorial videos, uh, let me know and we'll definitely try and get those done for you as well.